What's up, Thenix Athletes? It's Chris Heria. Today I'm going to be taking you through a workout that's like the holy grail for six pack abs. I've been doing this since the beginning of my calisthenics journey, and I can vouch that a lot of my progress came from doing this early on, and all you're going to need are two chairs. Not only are you going to develop complete shredded six pack abs from your obliques to your upper and lower abdominals, but you're also going to build the upper body strength required for exercises like dips and pull ups to even more advanced exercises like the full planche and handstand push ups. Making the rest of the fitness journey that you have ahead so much easier and allowing you to progress a lot faster. So if you're ready to get started, all you're going to need to do is download the Thenix app in the App Store or Google Play Store, or just hit the link down in the description below. Open up to the YouTube workout section, you'll be able to find this routine, and just smash the like button on this video for some extra motivation. We're ready to get started. We're going to be working out for eight minutes straight. We have eight exercises, all from lifting our bodies off these chairs. If there's any exercise that you can't do, or if you get too fatigued, you can always try tapping your feet on the ground with every repetition, or you can try the alternative exercise that I'll recommend. We're going to start from the easiest exercise to the hardest exercise, and the more you do this, you're also going to develop a solid L-sit if you don't already have one. So if you're ready to get started, all you need are two chairs, turn them sideways and we're ready to go. We're gonna do each exercise for 40 seconds on, the 20 second break in between. The first one is gonna be knee raises. Remember, if at any time you get fatigued or if this is too difficult, you can always put your feet down with every single rep, just like that. So here we go, 40 seconds on. Squeeze the grip, squeeze your core. Regulate your breathing. We're halfway there. Now this is mandatory to do at least two times a week if you really want to see a lot of progress. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. There you have it. Let's go ahead and take a 20 second rest. But like I was saying before, I was doing this routine at least two to three times a week. Now you don't have to do it that often, but because I was, I was progressing really fast and seeing a lot of results. Well, the next exercise coming up is gonna be alternating knee raises. It's gonna be the same exercise, just lifting up one knee at a time. Just like this. Remember, if this is too difficult, you can tap the ground. Everyone else, keep your feet up. Bring those knees up. Really feel the quality contraction, squeeze. We're halfway there. Squeeze the grip. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. This is gonna be one of your favorite videos to follow along to every single week. You're gonna see yourself building a defined six pack that you never could before and easily lifting up your body. Now we're gonna be moving on to corner raises, emphasizing on our obliques. So for this one, you wanna hold it a little more closer to the edge, allow your feet to come up and come to the side. Remember, you can always touch the ground every single rep until you're strong enough to do it without touching the ground, just like that. Halfway there. Remember to pace yourself. Squeeze every time. Five, four, three, two, and one. There we have it. Go ahead and stretch those out. Moving on to the next exercise, leg raises. Really emphasizing on our lower as well as our upper abdominal. With this exercise, we're starting to increase the difficulty because now our legs are extended, but it's also building us more strength in our abdominals and getting us closer to holding an L-sit. In fact, the longer you hold the top of your leg raise, you're actually holding an L-sit. So let's go for it. Remember, you can always tap the ground, free rep. But if this is just way too difficult, just do leg raises laying on the ground. Or continue the previous progression. Knee raises, we're halfway. Last 10 seconds. Bring those legs up. Five, 
four, three, two, and one. All right, there we have it. One of the best exercises that you can do for abs, leg raises. And by now, your abs should definitely be on fire, but we're halfway there. Coming up next is gonna be a bit more challenging. We're gonna be going for L-sit kicks. And because our legs are higher up, it's gonna require more abdominal strength. So if this is too difficult, you can just go to the ground and do seated in and outs. So we're gonna bring our legs up, kick out, and bring them in. So you see every single time we do an exercise, we're using our upper body as well. Triceps, grip, shoulders, halfway there. There's also many muscle groups in your body that help stabilize this exercise. This is gonna make any exercise that you're doing, lifting your entire body weight a lot easier. Last five seconds. Three, two, and one. There you have it. That one was definitely pretty tough, especially by this stage. All right, now get ready for the next one. It's getting a bit harder. We're going for L-sit, open, and close. Now, if this is too difficult, you can always do it in a tucked position, or you can do them on the ground in a seated position. Choose whatever progression you'd like, or start at the hardest progression that you can handle, and then as you get more fatigued, work your way down. I'll try that as well. So we're gonna go up, open, and close. Halfway, if you feel fatigued, you can always come into a tuck position and keep going. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we just have two more exercises to go. Coming up next, this one's gonna be just as challenging, if not a little bit more. We're gonna be going for L-sit flutters, and if this is too difficult, you can always move down to the ground and doing them laying or seated L-sit flutters. Start off with the most difficult progression you can do, and then move on to the easiest one as you fatigue. So L-sit, leg flutters. All right, halfway there. And if you're feeling fatigued, you can always stop really quick, catch your breath, go back up. Another progression you can do is put your legs a little lower and continue on. Five, four, three, two, and one. There you have it. My abs, even my upper body, shoulders, arms are on fire. We just have one last exercise to go. That's gonna be the L-sit hold. If you can't do an L-sit, just get straight into the tucked L-sit. And if any of these are too difficult, just get down on the ground and hold a bolt hold. Pick your progression and give it everything you got. This is the last one. Let's make it count. Get a good solid grip. Those legs up. Breathe. Lean back. Squeeze. Last 10 seconds for this L-sit hold. Three, two, one, tuck. Keep those knees up. Last 10 seconds. Four, three, two, and one. There you have it. My abs feel like bricks. My upper body has a crazy pump. Like I said at the beginning of this video, this is like the holy grail for six pack abs. A lot of my progress and results came from starting this early on. And I advise you to start that as well. Not only does it give you complete shredded six pack abs from your obliques, your upper and lower abdominals, but it also builds your upper body strength required for more advanced exercises like eventually the handstand push up, full planche push up, and so much more. Or even hold the L sit for a full 45 seconds. But if you enjoyed the video and you enjoyed the workout, please smash that like button. I really appreciate it and it helps YouTube share our videos to more people out there. And to show our appreciation, if you comment 
comment down below within 30 minutes of any upload, you're always gonna have a chance to win some Thenx apparel. So make sure you subscribe with notifications on right now so you never miss out on a video. We post every single Monday, 10 a.m. USA Eastern time. So make sure you're there on the dot. And don't forget to get this workout right on your phone, schedule it and do it at any time. Download the Thenx app in the App Store or Google Play Store and get full access to all our workout programs, technique guides, teaching you the most advanced movements step-by-step -step, like the full planche, handstand push-up, muscle-up, human flag, and so much more. We have plenty of follow along workouts and workout programs just like this that are gonna get you in the best shape of your life. And you'll also join the Thenx community of millions of Thenx athletes around the world using our programs to get in the best shape of their lives just like you. All you gotta do is download the Thenx app in the App Store or Google Play Store or just hit the link down in the description below and I'll see you inside. And now that you're getting shredded six-pack abs, check out this complete follow along full body workout that's gonna have you building solid lean muscle, not just looking strong, actually being strong.